You know my nigga so grimy. East side, bitch, I grew up in them 90s. Nigga, I ain't hard to find. Come and find me. Solo dolo, nigga, I don't need a crime. Can't no nigga or no bitch define me. So 10, bitch, I'm slime doing nine. Broke boy, have you ever touched a nine piece? This a hundred bed jug, I ain't lying. Nigga, I can fuck your bitch without trying. I can tell when a pussy nigga lying. If it's booth, then it's booth, I'm not buying. I spent 40 on some packs just to try it. Bitch, we been having money, I ain't lying. Well, we been up in the field, I ain't lying. I'm on these slime with a stick, niggas dying. Young niggas, we ain't have no guidance. Hey, Javon. Javon. Unk, um, that's you? Hell yeah, it's me, man. Get your ass in the truck, my nigga. Hell yeah. My little nigga, man. What's cracking with him, man? Are you going your mustache and all that? You ain't had that last summer. Hell yeah, man. Niggas getting older. But damn, Unk, you couldn't hop out and greet your nephew? Give me some love, my nigga. Damn. Hell yeah, no, I can't hop out right now, bro, for two reasons. Why? So many police out here, man. They can smell a nigga with no license a mile away, you know what I mean? Also, nigga, give me some ops out here. You never, never know I gotta lay low and shit. You know what I'm saying? But nigga, I know your skinny ass ain't ate. Nigga, you hungry? Trying to get some eats? Hell yeah, Unc, I'm starving. Let's go. Let's get to it, bro. You know what I'm saying? My nigga Javon got a mustache in this bitch, nigga. That's crazy. Man, I ain't never seen an eight-year-old try to beat up some teenagers, my nigga. <laughs> you was always a little nigga, baby, but you had heart for days, homie. Damn, Unc, well, this fool got me fooled in the mud. So what's up, man? What you trying to get into? You trying to get some pussy or something? I know this bomb ass spot, man, I be going to. Man, I got this thick ass Cambodian chick. I be wearing her ass out. I'm trying to fuck with that, we can do that. If you need some money, don't even trip, man, I got you. Man, Unc, I'm glad you brought that up. That's what I really want to talk to you about. Talk about what? Pussy or money? Both. All right, well shit, what's on your mind? Man, the real reason I came out here was Trying to get some money with you. Money with me? What you mean? You know what I mean, huh? I'll do whatever. I'll even put in that work. Oh, you gonna put in that work, huh? Hell yeah. Hmm. You look like your pops, man, when he was serious. He'd be proud of you. Is that right? Hell yeah. He wouldn't want to have his son out here being a whole ass nigga in these streets. Your daddy was a gangster. The realest motherfucker I knew. Niggas feared him. That's what those pussy ass niggas shot him in the back. Scared to face him like a real man. What's up, huh? All right, nah, nah, that's exactly what I used to say, man. Jason was too gangster, my nigga. If he knew who killed him, he would haunt that nigga to death right now. I miss my nigga. Damn. So yeah, man. That's why I'm looking forward to working with you, youngin. All right? Yeah, we're going to get some bread together for sure. Now about that other thing. What's up? What's on your mind? What other thing? Pussy, nigga. <laughs> you said you wanted to talk to me about some pussy, right? Oh, uh, shit. I almost forgot, Unc. Look, I got this little shorty lined up. I need you to drop me off at her crib. What you mean you got something lined up already? You ain't been here in a year, little nigga. <laughs> Would you crack something from last summer and kept in touch with something? The power of the internet. I've been talking to this girl for months now. She's been sending me pictures and all that. She know what's up. Look, check this out. Oh, mm -hmm. shit. Look, mama thick as fuck. Okay, you're going to have fun with that. Shit, when you trying to get dropped off? Right now. She stay on the, uh, on the other side of the 110. On the east side? Mm, you could say. But she good, though. She don't bang. She not with none of that. Her family, non-affiliates. Oh. Yeah, whatever, man. Hey, uh, send me the address and I'll put it in my GPS. I got you. Yeah. This nigga over here got pussy lined up and shit. <laughs> I got the juice. Hop in the ride, light up the L, check up the deuce. Hey, yo, nephew. This alley looks sketchy as fuck, my nigga. You sure she gave you the right address? Yeah, yeah, I'm sure I gave you the right address. I text her. I'm outside. Yeah, all right. Hey, hold up. Who's this pulling up? That might be her. Nah. This car is suspect. Hey, right, passing my heat from out the glove compartment.
That's for my daddy, you bitch ass nigga. I did it, bro. I did it, bro. Get me the fuck out of here. Oh my God, Andre! What happened to you? Just gotta give it some time. I'm patient. What up, C? Everything good? Yeah, everything good. Breeze was just about to leave. Yeah, I was. But I'm just glad we can come to terms. I hope your man Dre's on board so we can put this shit to bed once and for all. Like I said, I can't make no promises. But I'll let him know. It's a good proposal. So we'll see. That's all I can ask for. Good looking out. Well, I'm gonna uh, get up out of here and go handle some business. I'm gonna leave you niggas to it. Peace out, little homie. Yeah, uh huh. Well, you be safe out here in these streets. Always. Smart. What's up? What up, nigga? You not gonna tell me what's going on? You ain't gonna explain that? Ain't nothing going on, man. He just came here to make a proposal about us working together. A good one at that. So what Dre think about that? I don't know, man. Dre was supposed to be here at the meeting. Matter of fact, I've been hitting him, and he ain't hit me back. Hit him up real quick. I hit him 15 minutes ago. He ain't answering me either. And he ain't tell me nothing about no meeting with no ops. Hmm. Now that I think about it, he was supposed to hit me up last night. When last time you heard from him? Yesterday. He said he was going to pick Jovan up from the airport. Well, shit, let's call Jovan then. Yeah, let me hit Jovan. Yo, come in. Oh, man, look who it is. Uh, what up? Look at Rock, him. Rock, what's up? What's up, man? What a dude what's up? Up? Yeah. what up, Neff? Man, what's up? What's look at up? you all grown. Yeah. OK? You know what I'm saying? Looking more and more like your dad every day. Every time I see him, you tell me the same thing. I do. I do. But where's Dre at? Park in the car? Nah, he not with me. He told me to meet him up here. The fuck you mean? Where he at? So I don't know. He dropped me off last night and told me to meet him up here this afternoon. You ain't seen him since last night too? Man, what the fuck is going on? So he dropped you off at his crib and told you to meet him here? And he just bounced? Yeah, but he ain't take me to his crib. He took me to this little shorty spot. What show do you know out here? So this little chick I met off the internet. We've been talking for like five, six months now. She stay on Broadway. Huh? On the east side? Yeah. Why, what's up? What's up? Man, you know them east side dudes don't rock with us like that. Man, this shit don't smell right. AOC, what we need to do is get at him, snatch somebody up, and make his ass talk. Calm the fuck down, Commando. What is like 10 crews on the east side? What you gonna do? Kill them all. This nigga's crazy. You, tell me exactly where Dre drops you off. Hold up, man, I got the address right here. Dre! Yo, C, where the fuck is Dre? Sue, we ain't got time for this. We trying to figure that out now. Nah, fuck that, okay? Because the last time he was gone all night, that nigga played himself and came home with empty condom wrappers in his... Wait, what the fuck you mean you trying to figure that out? Ain't nobody seen or heard from him 
since yesterday. Why didn't call all the precincts in the hospitals in the city? And he ain't dead or in jail, so where the fuck he at? Why you got that confused ass look on your face? My uncle missing, man. I'm trying to figure out where the fuck he could be. Javon, oh my gosh, give me a hug. Look at you all grown and shit, nigga got facial hair. I ain't even recognize you. What's up, auntie? You tell me where the fuck your uncle at. That's what I'm trying to figure out. Yeah, let's figure it out. See what you gonna do about it. Well, everybody need to get on their phones, put the word out. Somebody knows something. Then put that word out. Damn, girl. What up? It's your scary ass. My bad. What the fuck, Cecil? You can't be sneaking up on me like that. Liable to get shot. Okay, killer. Don't hurt me with that little deuce deuce you keep in your purse. What's up? What you doing here? What, I just can't come see my fam? Yeah, okay. Your ass ain't been here since my housewarming party last year. What, your mama finally got you to come pick up her pot? You were supposed to come get it last week. You already know. She been cussing me out about that pot for like two days. Yeah, I know. All right, I'm gonna I'm go get it for you. I'll be right out. Well, she ain't gonna invite your cousin? You got a nigga in there you hiding or something? What? No. I'm I'm sorry, cuz. Forgive me. Come on in. <laughs> nah, I'm just fucking with you. I'm gonna be out here. I gotta make a phone call anyway. Okay, cool. I, I'll, I'll be right back. You know what? Actually, I got a piss, so I'm gonna come in. Okay, come on. No, oh, okay. So you hooked it up in here. Yeah, I did. You like? Yeah, let me check it out. Oh, hold on. Let me let me make sure I don't have a bra or something laying around. Okay, we're good. I know I am. You good, eh? Yeah, of course. You acting weird. Whatever. I'm about to use the bathroom and get up out of here. Where are you going? That's that's not the bathroom. That one. All right, my bad. So with the hospitality though, can't give a nigga a water. That's why your ass pissing now. Be your own fan. Fine. I'll get you a water. Hey, what's that air freshener in here? That that's actually not air freshener. That's my four sisters' body spray. Oh, that shit smell good as fuck. They make men stuff too. You want me to see if I can get you some? Oh, you got to. Okay, cousin. Here's your water. Hey, what up with you? You ain't never been the one to be so jumpy. Long day, I, I worked a double shift. It's just, it's, it's a lot. You need to take your ass a nap or something. You right. Let me, let me walk you out. Oh shit, the layer. I almost forgot. When last time you heard from Dre? What? Why would you ask me about him? Fuck you mean? Nigga was the love of your life. <laughs> I don't fuck with that nigga. He could show up at my door bleeding on my porch and I'd leave his ass there. Why you ask about him anyway? He been missing for like two days. Maybe he snuck into the hospital under an alias. You check for me? I'm not getting involved with that street shit you and your friends is into. 
That's why I stopped fucking with Dre in the first place. All right. If you hear anything, let me know at least. All right. For sure. All right. See you around, family. Okay, so what up? Y'all got some info for me? Yeah, my homegirl from Flint told me about this chick that was at the salon the other day, talking crazy, talking about how her nigga make dudes disappear. Bitches in salons, always talking. Okay, so? So we found out where she stayed and we paid her ass a visit. I hope y'all was nice to the young lady. <laughs> you know we were. Who is it? Charlotte. Oh, hey. Oh, hey, guys. What's up? Come on in. Uh, it is right in the back. I don't know what's wrong with it. All I know is it just won't flash. I'm sorry, ma'am. I think you got us confused. We're here for Josh. I'm sorry, I thought you guys were the plumbers I've been waiting for all day. So wait, you're friends of Josh? Actually, we ain't his friends. So she just gave him up with ease? Yeah, I guess you could say that. Okay, so talk to me. What's she saying? She said he basically always talking about how he make niggas disappear. Yeah, and she said he threatened her the other day, telling her how she don't want to end up missing like Dre. Yeah? So where this motherfucker at? She's talking about he be at the strip club every Sunday, like his church. That's where she met him at. Perfect. So pay his ass a visit and make it quick and quiet. Cause if he don't tell me what I want to know, his ass gonna be the one disappearing. Hmm. Say no mas. That was my last wood. This nigga better hurry up or your ass gonna have to be taking a Zyron. I got some buzz in the back, I'll hook you up. Man, you know I don't smoke that bullshit. Sound crazy, you got some fire. I just copped some last week when I first touched down. Bro, what's the difference from what y'all call Zy in Frisco and what we call Zy out here in LA? And what you mean last week? You ain't even been here a full week. Last week, cause today's Sunday, fool. It's a whole new week. I ain't from Frisco, from LA. I grew up here. Mom just had me out there because of shit that happened with Pops. Nigga, you already know. My oh, nigga, what are you, what, like 19? 20. Exactly. Your Pops died when you was what, 11 or 12? You been living in Frisco more than half your life. You a Frisco nigga. Own that shit. I'm from LA, bro. Born and raised. I came out here every single summer. Anyways, what's up with old boy? Look like he not coming out. We need to figure something out and come back tomorrow or something. What the fuck? Nigga, we'll be out here all night if we have to. You forgot why we was out here in the first place? Because my G homie took your ass to a motherfucking hood where he know he wasn't supposed to be in the first place. So you should be the first motherfucker trying to figure out what happened to Drake. I'm ready to do whatever to find Hunt. I'm just saying, maybe we need to regroup and try again tomorrow. Regroup and come back tomorrow? See, that's the shit I'm talking about. That's that Frisco shit. Out here? If one of ours come up missing, we do whatever to find it. So it's time for you to step up. If you want to be a real L.A. nigga. Whatever, nigga. I'm a real L.A. Hold up. Ain't that old boy coming out the spot right now? Man, that is that nigga. This motherfucker been in here the whole time. You ready? Let's roll, nigga. My bullshit chasing this paper. I got no time to be spending on hate. It's balling and smoking. Thank you on waiters. Do me your favor. Don't do me no favor. You not in my lane. I see you later. Get you blade.
inside. And he said a word. Either he don't know nothing, or he one tough motherfucker. We'll see. Fuck this nigga up. What? What up, yo? Yo, nothing, B, but yo, I really gotta talk to him, for real. Talk to me about what? Yo, chill, man. It's about that thing. What thing? It's a nice thing? No, no, no. Shh, no. It's that other thing, man. <sighs> fucking guy. Make it in the room. Yeah. Hey, talk about your fucking thing. Oh, fuck. Dre. Oh, you're up. Are you? Oh. Are you okay? How are you feeling? I'm hungry. Got something to eat. Boy, I'm talking about your health. Do you have any pain in your chest? Any tightness when you breathe? Nah, it's my stomach. What? Your stomach hurts? Yeah, it's empty. Can I have something to eat, please? Yeah, I'll get you something to eat. After I change these bandages. But while I'm doing that, I need you to tell me something. What? Who did this to you? Listen, Josh. You're taking all this pain for no reason. Your girl Yolanda, she already gave you up. How you think we know you had something to do with this? Just tell me what happened. That bitch is lying. <coughs> I'm telling y'all the truth. I don't know shit about what happened to your boss. <coughs> Not my boss, nigga. It's my brother. You got one more chance. No, I'm a girl. I'll tell you. I'm telling you the truth. Okay, all right, all right, all right, all right. I'll tell you everything I know. <coughs> See, I knew you knew something, Josh. So tell me what you know. I just overheard some shit. So what'd you hear? Okay, but if I tell you what I heard, are you guys gonna let me go? Of course, Josh. Just tell me what you know. Her drill from Medina telling someone over the phone that he was mad that someone else got to Dre first. I swear that's all I know. So you telling me you heard one dumb motherfucker tell another dumb nigga that they was mad that somebody else got to Dre first? How the fuck is that supposed to help me? I don't know. But I swear, man, that's all I know. I know it is, Josh. Uh, how you doing? Ah, uh, why are you pressing so hard? Oh, stop whining, you big baby. Can I get back to my food now? I don't care what you do. Just hurry up and get better so you can get out of here. Now that I told you what you want to know. Can I ask you a question? What's that? Why you ain't taking me to the hospital? I called the homies. Because I knew by you coming here that you didn't want the cops involved. And two, you were shot from close range. You don't let anybody get that close to you unless you trust them. So I didn't call the homies because I don't want to potentially call your attempted killer. You was always the smart one. Why let you go again? Let me go? <laughs> Nigga, please. I'll let you go. I told you it was me or the streets, and your ass chose the streets. Yeah. That's when you ran off and got your medical degree and forgot all about your boy. Yep. 
I'm gonna forget about my boy again as soon as you can take 10 steps on your own because that's the exact number of steps it is from my door to the curb. And when you get out there, keep walking and don't you ever look back, especially not for me to save your life from gunshot wounds. If anybody finds out about this, I could lose everything I have fought my entire life for. You're right. I'm sorry for putting you in this situation, but I'm grateful. You saved my life. I owe you. You're welcome. Just don't ever mention it. Literally. I won't. But I do got one more question to ask you. What is it? Where's my truck? I put it in my garage and covered it up. But why are you asking about that? You ain't in no condition to be driving? Because I need my phone. Baby, you home? <sighs> hey, babe. What are you doing, home? Uh, let me help you with those. You're home early. Yeah, well, we got something to talk about. You might not like it. But uh, let's put these groceries away first and then we can talk, cool? Okay. You ready to talk about it? There's no beating around the bush, baby. I lost my job today. You're joking. No, but I'm, it's okay. Look, I'm already looking for another one. Plus, we still have our savings, so we should be okay for a couple of months. A couple of months? No, I, I was looking forward to your next few paychecks to pay off some of the bills. What are you talking about? We're barely getting by. I, I didn't want to bring it up because I knew it would stress you out. But if you're not bringing any money home, we're fucked. What about our savings? We don't have any savings left. The, the smoothies, the strawberries, the blueberries, the fucking plastic cups. Everything's gone up in prices. Inflation, inflation fucking has us by our necks. Even our rent, our rent went up 150 on January 1st. Okay, okay, look, I I'll take care of it, all right? Just don't worry. You better, or we're getting evicted. Thought it was a freak. Oh, I know she was. Yeah, man, all she kept asking during the day was, "Who's he doing next?" Hey, what's up, Dre? God me, damn. Cool, Don't you know, get like, stupid. Movie, How you feeling? Said, nah. well, I was cool until I got up to get these bag of chips off the dresser. And nigga got dizzy, had to sit back down. Okay, baby steps. Take it slow, but not too slow, because I still need your ass up out of here as soon as possible. Really? Yeah, really. I just had to cut my date off early so I can come check on your ass. Change your bandages. You ain't my man for me to be taking care of you the way I have these last couple weeks. Yeah, I get it. And I can't thank you enough, all right? Sorry you had to cut your little date off early. But if you got an itch you need scratched, y'all can help you out with that, right? 
I could kill you right now, horny as I am. Ooh, if I didn't hate your ass so much, I'd take you up on that offer. But it's not gonna happen. So let me go get the stuff so I can tend to your wounds. Yeah, I... Damn. You better calm the fuck down, because we're not doing this. See what you got on. You know what I'm doing. Yeah, okay, don't play with me. I ain't trying to play with you. I'm trying to have my way with you. No, uh, uh, I, can't, I can't do this. Alea, you're a grown ass woman. You can do what the hell you want. gotta go. Dre. Dre. I hate you. I hate that you couldn't be this peaceful for me. I hate that I still love you. Good night, Andre. Papi, you're gonna catch a cold stand out here by yourself. Yo, hurry up the park, bro. My boy. What up, what up? What's up? Let's go. Yo, what's good? We going up? Nah, let me holler at you real quick, bro. You good? Yeah, yeah. Uh, <clears throat> what's up? You got any jobs for me? What you mean? Come on, man. You know what I mean. Nah, you finally decided to fuck with your boy. Pause. Wait, aren't you on parole? Yeah, don't worry about that. I'm good with parole. I just saw his ass last week, and next month is the last time I got to see this motherfucker. My boy, I got the perfect job for you. I mean, the perfect one, bro. There's this couple that I've been casing for about three weeks up in the hills. Loaded, son. Every time they step out, brand new jewelry. One of them even wears a brand new watch for each day of the week, son. Every Saturday night, they go out. It's like clockwork. This is the one. Sounds good. Let's do it this Saturday. My Ooh. boy. Welcome back. Yo, you coming? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm telling you, bro. This one's the one that's going to take us to the moon, son. You know, like. Let's get it. Yo, if they got extra, they don't need it, you they know? They don't need it, bro. You know, they, they, got fucking, they got spared. You don't even feel bad. I don't sound.
So what up? You hear anything yet? Nothing yet. You gotta be alive. I want him found, and I want him dead. Yeah, I know. Is that what we're doing here? Because I was just out there trying to handle that right now. Nah, I got another job for you. OK. So what is it? Bobby. Bobby Boomer? Yes, Bobby and Boomer. He sells a lot of weight to his people. He earns a lot of money for you. Yeah. Well, his people are our people now. So what I need him for? Plus, he's been talking crazy. Talking crazy? Yeah. He been saying to whoever want to listen, if Dre did, he know who did it. Guess who he's saying did it? You. Exactly. OK, so? OK, so. You Spanish niggas ain't too bright, huh? Nah. Some things you got to spell out for us. Because from where I'm standing, he ain't lying. I think it's good that the word gets spread around. Put some fear in these suckers' hearts. Like I said, not too bright. It's going to put fear in some suckers' hearts, but not real ones. Not the ones that'll die for Dre. What's that mean? We're going to be split in half. Some of them suckers going to get with them others. Then we f***ed. OK, I see your point. Yeah, but uh, why we just don't tell him the truth? We killed him because he killed Pops. Ain't nobody going to believe that, nephew. You know how many times I try to tell the homies, try to convince them with subtle hints and shit? Dre got them motherfuckers wrapped around his finger. We the only ones that know the truth. We all we got. So we got to go about it this way. You down now? Yeah. I'm down. I'm with you, huh? Cool. Y'all down? Yeah, we down. I just got one question. Talk. Who takes control of Bobby's business? It's yours if you want it. Under one condition. My nephew gets 20%. For what? Because he about to go with y'all to handle this business. Well, I got to take him with us. We don't need him. Because I said so, nigga. And I brought him on so he can go with y'all. Plus, he got to earn his stripes. Stripes? After that work I put in last time? And what the fuck did you do last time? Make a nigga go missing? What, you got a body somewhere I don't know about? We go to a funeral yesterday or some shit? He's still missing. Well, you want me to take him with us? Whatever. Call me when the shit is done. Get in the back. And don't say shit. Come on, babe, hurry up. I'm like, hey, I'm not the one's late. Oh God, here you go. And um, don't drink too much tonight. Bingo, here we go. Is that them right there? That's them, all right. Told you, like clockwork. All right, let's wait for them to pull off and then uh, I'm gonna jump this gate. It's cold, baby. Just like the good old days. But now you need to be on your back to get over We're not, we're not gonna, um, do that crazy shit. All right, bro. Park three houses down and honk the horn twice if anything happens, if you see them coming back or anything, you know what I mean? Dude, you're talking to me like I'm some kind of amateur. We're not honking horns, it's the 21st century. Here, take one of these. 
Some 007 shit? Even better. I'll be in your ear the whole time. Pause. I got your back. Yo, you sure this shit's gonna fucking work, bro? Is it gonna work? Come on, man. Cat thieving's like riding a bike. You don't forget. And plus, you're one of the best. You got this. Yeah. Good looking out, bro. Come on. Yeah, yeah. All right, let's get this. Let's go, baby. Oh, Bo, get in the car, get in the car, get in the car, let's go, let's go, let's go. Yo, what the fuck? So what happened? They all killed each other. The fuck you mean they killed each other? Like I said, they all killed each other. Except for that fucking kid. Hold the, wait, what kid? Start from the beginning. All right, all right, so I jumped the fence, right? Hey, yo, how's it looking? I'm about to go to work. I don't know, bro. I'm around the corner. What the fuck you doing around the corner? Motherfucker, you told me to park three houses down. What was I supposed to do? Corner first. Just get over here, man. You're supposed to be my fucking eyes. All right, all right. I'll be right there. I just pulled up and the car is back. You gotta get up out of this. What the fuck? You serious? It is back. Get the fuck up out of this. You with that goddamn social media. What do you mean me and that goddamn oh, social shit. media? Everybody does Yo, it. bro, you really need to get the fuck up out of there. Three guys just walked in. What the fuck you mean three other dudes just showed up? They look like goons, but I don't think they gangsters. They look like goons, but they ain't gangsters? What the fuck is that supposed to mean? They're driving a fucking Tesla. We got there, Speedy started talking shit to the dude instead of popping him. They started arguing about some bullshit and your name popped up. See, Andre, are you sure you heard those names right? My name popped up. Yeah, nigga. They was talking about they knew you was the one that killed Dre. This shit's bigger than I thought. That white boy was tripping. He stabbed Nero in the chest. After he stabbed Nero in the chest, Speedy pulled out his gun and shot him. After he shot him, Bobby pulled out his gun and shot Speedy. Everybody was shooting. I ran out that motherfucker blasting. So you ran to the nigga, and then what? That's when he put the gun in my face and he tried to kill me. Who? I don't know. I don't know the nigga from a can of paint. I just know the nigga looked like Colin Kaepernick. So he got your sweater. Did you have anything in it? No, I didn't have anything in it. So what, what about fingerprints? When did you lose your gloves? I, I took them off right before I fucking jumped out and saw you. Go, oh, Bo, get in the car, get in the car, get in the- So all you got was his face? And you let this nigga get away? After hearing my name and all that shit? Yeah, he got away, but not for long. Look what I found in his jacket. Well, look at here. So we know where you're gonna be. Time and place. Good shit, man. Damn, I'm 
all this shit we went through, and at the end of the day, for nothing. Well, technically, I wouldn't say it was for nothing. My dog. Whose car is that? What car? That car? Yeah, nigga, that car. That's Bobby shit. And you brought that shit here? Get rid of that shit, nigga. Get the fuck out my car, man. Cause I'm slime with a chop. These niggas jetty cast on my mom. Cause I'm fucking with them gangsters and flock up. All my bitches bad and they pop her. Bro, you was hiding behind the van and everything. Man, hiding my Man, you got me mistaken. That was your ass. That was me, wasn't it? Man, but I ain't tripping on that. Mama ain't raised no fool. I had to get up out of them niggas was shooting. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Shit, but what them hoes gonna be on tonight, my nigga? Shit, they gonna be on whatever we on. That's why I got this. Oh, for sure. Yeah, it's that get right. Damn, my nigga, these hoes living like this. Man, come on, man. You know me, everything top notch, man. Hell yeah. Shit look empty though. Where they at? I don't know, man. Let me see. Crazy. Oh, they had texted me. They said they went to the liquor store. They shared the door unlocked, so we good. Man. All right, for sure. Said it's going to be four of them, right? Man, you already know what that means. Three for me, one for you. <laughs> nah, nigga, I was thinking quite the opposite. Shit, you lucky I brought you on this, man. You want to be all wifed up in the house with wifey. And I'm trying to live right, my nigga. Yeah. Yeah, man, go ahead and grab us some glasses out the cabinet, man. For sure, for sure. Shit, these bitches better be bad, though, my nigga. I know you ain't down with me, nigga. Uh, that's true, you do know how to pull. Come on, man, I keep a bad one, man, you feel me? Or four in this case. Which yeah, it's gonna be a good night, man. You already know. Don't have a seat. Hey, bro, tell me that story when um, remember you was hitting old girl and her dude uh, came in there and caught y'all. Had you spooked? <laughs> you love this story, dog. It's my favorite story, nigga. So boom, I'm in Shardy crib, right? I'm straight tearing her shit down, my nigga. You feel me? We making macaroni and cheese noises and all that. Wow. Wow, wow, beating that shit up. They say, you know, I hear a nigga at the front door losing his fucking mind. Boom, 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 boom. Charlene, Charlene. I'm in the crib laughing at the nigga because I'm fucking this bitch, you know what I'm saying? They say, you know, I hear this nigga kick the door in and I hear a pistol cock. I'm like, nah, my nigga, I ain't going out like no buster. So I get up out of bed. Yeah, yeah nigga, carry on. Continue. So I get out of bed like butt ass naked, my nigga, like and I fucking I let one off in the living room. Bow! Like, like that that nigga ain't a gangster no more. You know what I'm saying? He ran up out of there, like quick, fast, and in a hurry. So then I turn around and confront Shorty. I look like, where the fuck she at? Tucked underneath the sheets. Lift that shit up. She in the fetal position, my nigga. Shit all over the bed. Bro. <laughs> oh, I love that story, nigga. <laughs> You know it was me, my nigga. I didn't. You just told me. All right. Let me at least call my girl. What? I told you earlier she been holding me down. Let me call my girl and say my goodbyes. Man, go ahead. Hurry up, man. If you try any stupid shit, that's gonna be the last thing she hear on the other side. I promise I ain't gonna say nothing crazy, man. Right?
too. Hello. Hey, baby. Just calling to let you know that I love you. Hey, sweetie. <laughs> I know that. I love you too. Yeah, but, but I need you to I need you to understand that you my ace, you always held me down. I love you, you know that? <laughs> I do. And you already said that. I said I love you. Well, I need to know that you understand that I love you. Alright. You're starting to scare me. Is everything okay? Yeah, everything's cool. I'm still coming through for dinner and all that, baby. Okay. Well. Well, yes. I love you. You know that. All right. I, I gotta let you go. All right. I'll, I'll see you later. For sure. Bye. Bye. What up, see what you doing here? What up? Came over here to check on you. About what? You handle that business? Come on, man, you know I did. And I appreciate you too, that's good looking out. Yeah, you family, bro. Yeah? Somebody run up at my grandma's house, take my stash. I know you would've did the same. No questions asked. Told you I'd find him, and I did. Yeah, you did that. Do me a favor. What's that? Stay by the shop. Just in case we hear anything about Dre. Say no mas, I got you. One. Jovan! Hey, Jovan! K-Rock, what up? What up, fool? Yeah, what's the deal? Where you been at, man? Nigga ain't seen you in a couple days. My man low. Man low? See, there you go with that Frisco shit. You supposed to be out here hugging a block trying to get that bag. You got against Frisco niggas, man. So I love, baby. I'm a California nigga at heart. And I'm also a Dallas Cowboy fan. Y'all put us out every season. I see why you be on that bullshit now. But look, I want to holler at you about something, though. What you want to talk to me about? Said about what happened to my pops. See if you remember anything. Shit, I just started messing with the homies around that time. And I was young. One thing I can say, though, he always was good to me. And he was one to be respected, unlike you. There you go again with that bullshit. I'm just joking with you, bro. I'm just joking. But what made you ask me that anyway? I just been thinking. Especially the shit that happened with Dre. What happened with Dre? We don't even know what happened with Dre. You know what I mean. Him being missing and all that. Shit, well, speaking of Dre, one thing I do remember is he was out here wilding when your pops got killed. What you mean? Shit, anybody he heard has something to do with that. He was on a bumper. What? Shit, you don't know? You better ask around. Hey, shit, anyway, I'm about to go grab something to eat. You trying to roll? All right. Shit, come on. Dre! I stopped by that soul food spot we used to go to together. Got your favorite. I'm right here. Oh, what are you doing? I see you got on the sweatsuit I bought you. It looks nice. Oh, yeah. Thank you. You got me out here looking like Mr. Jameson from PE class. <laughs> Mr. Jameson. I wonder what his mean ass is up to. Yeah, he was mean as shit. Mm-hmm. So, looks like you're feeling better. Yeah, I took my 10 steps today. I know you told me to take him towards the curb, but uh, he was gone and I don't want to leave without saying thank you. I appreciate that. Yeah, um, and uh, if you could do me one last favor. What's up? I'm walking cool, but uh, I don't think I should drive yet. 
So I'm gonna need you to drive my truck to the meetup spot with the homies. Dre, I'm not trying to let nobody see me with you. Alea, come on now. I'm gonna make sure you go on before they get there. Ain't nobody gonna see you. Yeah, all right. I guess I could uh, just get picked up from there. Okay, you gonna eat before you go or nah? That's Devos? You know it. Hell yeah. But let me make this call real quick, cool? Okay, I'll, I'll get this ready. Thank you. You welcome, nigga. Damn, that food was smacking, bro. You already know that's my spot, man, for that good Asian cuisine. Yo. Yo, it's me. Dre, man, it's good to hear your voice. What's been up, man? Where you been at? Before we get into all that, who you with? Shit, I'm right here with Neff. Put me on speaker. All right, yeah. You on speaker right now, what's up? Yo, what up, Neff, you? Javon. What up, huh? Shit, man. Niggas hit me, little bro. Who shot you, man? What the fuck? What's going on? I don't know, Rock. I don't remember shit. Fuck you mean you don't remember shit? My doc said it could be from all the blood loss. On my brain not getting enough oxygen. All I know is I woke up shot up in my truck. Of all places on the east side. Yeah. That's where you dropped me off, huh? Why the fuck I'm dropping you off on the east side, man? You dropped me off at that shorty crib. You don't remember? Nah, I don't remember none of that. But we can talk about it when y'all scoop me up. So where you want us to come scoop you from? I'm gonna drop a pen in about a half hour. But listen, don't tell nobody else I'm back, all right? Especially not that nigga C. I don't want that nigga wildin'. You know how he can get. I'm gonna tell him myself. Say no mas. I'm gonna see y'all later. All right, one. My ride will be here in a couple minutes when your people's getting in. Oh. As soon as you dip out and I've dropped the pin. Look, Dre. I was contemplating on telling you this, but Cecil came by my house the other day while you were in a coma. Why you ain't tell him I was there? Same reason you came to me instead of him when you got shot. Look, Cecil's my cousin and I love him, but he gave me bad vibes the other day. He claims he came over just to pick up my auntie's pot, but he never even took the pot when he left. I know you have a plan, but you trust in your nephew after he shot you? That shit's crazy to me. Just be careful. Oh, so now you care about me? I didn't say all that. I'm just, I'm just saying. Look, I appreciate you looking out, but I can handle mine. I do got a plan. I'm gonna be all right. Here, keep taking these for the pain. Thank you. I appreciate you nursing the nigga back to health. Should never let you get away, huh? Don't start that. I'm praying for you, Andre. You know there's a better life out there for you. Just take care of yourself, please. It's my ride. Yo.
my nigga. Thought I wasn't gonna never see your ass alive and breathing again. Well, see, it's good to be seen, my nigga. Man, I hear that. Yo, Javon, you ain't gonna come greet your uncle? Yeah, aunt. I'm just surprised, man. Just came out here and all this shit started happening. It's crazy. It is what it is. It's the life we chose, you feel me? Your pops was in it. We in it. And now you win it. You ready for that though, right? Yeah. Yeah, I'm ready, huh? Cool. I need to find out who the fuck did this shit though. You ain't tell nobody else I was here though, right? Nah. I ain't tell nobody. Hey, but what about C though? He been tripping since you been missing. I still don't want C to know I got hit up. I need one more day to sit back and think and figure it out tomorrow. So what you need us to do right now? I need you to drive me off at Sue's spot. Man, she was out here tripping with her little goonettes looking for you too. That's what's up. I need to get my ass for a crib quick. I need this pain medication wearing off. Yo, nephew, you driving. All right, man, I'm about to go upstairs, all right? Get my mind right. But y'all niggas on call 24-7, all right? Like if I hit y'all in the next 10 minutes, y'all here in five, all right? Come on, man, you already know I'm like 7-Eleven. I'm always up for business. Whoa. Hey, Javon, I need you to take my truck and come scoot me back up in the morning. Got you, huh? My nigga, be careful, all right? They see my truck back on the streets, they might think you me. Take the back streets and shit like that, all right? Or, hey, yo, Dre, but like, what's the plan though? Like, feel me? Like, is we gonna get at these east side niggas or what? Nah, not yet. We can't start no war not knowing if it's them or not. Not knowing if it's them or not. He said you dropped him off on the east side. You said you woke up hit on the east side. This shit ain't rocket science, bro. One and one makes two. Rock, I know you wanna fuck shit up right now, but this shit, I gotta think about it, alright? Because <clears throat> this shit just seemed too fucking familiar, my nigga. Familiar? What you mean? I got the fucked up feeling that whoever popped me is the same niggas that killed your pops back in the day. Wait, first you asked me about your pops, and then now you bring up Jason? Man, I don't believe in no coincidences. Man, what made you say that? Man, I had this pain medication wearing off, nigga. My head's spinning. I can't think about that right now, man. I'm gonna go upstairs and get my shit right, all right? But in the meantime, just know this. If I'm right about what I'm thinking, my nigga, me and you both gonna get our get back, all right? Real soon. All right, huh? See y'all niggas tomorrow. You, girl. Where the fuck you uh, been at? Out fucking bitches? I got shot up, all right? Had to lay low and recover. What? Where? In my chest. No. Where you been recovering, Dre? I done called all the hospitals under your alias and you wasn't at no hospital in California. I'm gonna tell you, all right? Just let me sit down and rest for a minute. Who shot you? Sue, I don't know, all right? I don't remember shit. How you don't remember shit, Dre? Can the nigga sit the fuck down for a minute? All right, go on get your rest. I was about to hop in the shower anyway, but when I get out, I'ma need that D. Sue, I just told you I got shot up. So, did you get shot in your dick, nigga? I haven't had sex in weeks. I'm horny as hell. Dre, don't play with me. Yeah, 
<laughs> Recovering this pussy, nigga. <sighs> Crazy ass girl. Acting like niggas don't get shot every day. Shut the fuck up. Yo, you fuck. Your phone was ringing earlier. Oh, that's just Natalia. What the fuck you doing? Why'd you just lie to me? I know that we'll see someone on the phone. Then why you ain't just say that? Sue. Tell me why you lied to me. Andre, get this gun out my fucking face. I'm not fucking playing with your ass. You gonna tell me what's going on. Right the fuck down. Look, I didn't tell you that it was C on the phone because I know you would have been on that bitch for hours. Or you would have ran your ass up out of here. And I wanted some dick. With no interruptions. Get out! I'm sorry, all right? I said get the fuck out of my place. Chill, Sue. I, my mind ain't right right now. I'm thinking all I'm, on. I'm all over the place. You I'm think fucking... I give a fuck about that? When you just put a gun to my motherfucking face? I said get the fuck out. Now! Damn, you really wasn't playing about that 10 minutes, huh? What happened? Trouble in paradise? You and I both know ain't shit with your auntie paradise. Let's roll, man. Put that cigar out. You ain't make no biscuits. Do I look like Popeyes to you? Yo, what up? Stupid, Drew. That picture of your bed. Look at my what? Oh, yeah, I'm just gonna sit there by mistake. Mistake? So that text was meant for somebody else? Alright, where are you at now? Yeah, exactly. Look. So who was it meant for? Some bitch. I'll be right over there. No, man, what are you talking about? So if it wasn't for a bitch, then who was it for? One of your friends? Yeah. Everything alright? He's still alive.
and you still fucking lying? Is it because you fucking somebody I know? I'll be back. You set this whole shit up just to hurt me. Cecil. You gonna make sure you do that shit yourself this time, right? You know I am. Make sure it's done right. Yes, ma'am. Good? Yeah, I'm straight. All oh, this movement got me sore as fuck. Mile at you. Aunt, I wanna ask you something real quick. What's good? I know you say you can't remember a lot right now, but why you think your shooting got something to do with my pops? I'm gonna keep it honey with you. Like I said, I don't remember shit. But uh, I promise you by tomorrow, Everything be a lot more clearer for you, all right? How'd you want? Get better soon, man. Get some rest. All right. Tomorrow. Tomorrow. Oh, fuck. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Thank you, detective. If, if you hear anything, can you please let me know? Yeah, yeah, I'll, 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 I'll keep in touch. Okay, all right, thanks, bye. Stupid motherfucker. What'd he say? Nothing, girl. They don't know shit. These motherfuckers are clueless. He's calling me to ask me if I had any new information. What? So he wants you to do his job. Exactly. You know they don't know shit, okay? I know something is wrong. I feel it in my bones. Don't jump to conclusions. We don't know anything yet. Okay, but I know him. I know that even if he was out all night sneaking around, he would have came back home around four or five. Okay, he wouldn't have stayed out all night. Okay. So tell me again, what did he say when he called you? That he loved me. Since when he was romantic type? He said that he loved me and that he needed me to understand. It's weird. I just... I should have said I understood. You didn't? No, because I didn't believe him. But if I'm the last person he called before something possibly hey, happened- Hey, don't think like that, okay? It is not your fault. Yeah, I know, okay? But damn, bitch. It's gonna be all right. Fuck. Does his brother know that he's missing? No, he hasn't called yet, but he's gonna be released in a couple days. And You'll find out soon enough. I hope nobody did no dumb shit. And I hope Martin shows up before he gets out because you know that motherfucker will start a war. You ready? Let's go with it. What up, what up? What's the urgency? Talk to me. I'm gonna be honest with you, bro. I need that money. I need my cut, like, ASAP. Bro, you know we can't sell this shit, man. It's hot right now, especially with everything going on. You gotta wait for it to cool down. Look, I get that. I get that all. I understand, but my girl's bitching at me every fucking day. Yo, if I don't get this money, I'm gonna be evicted. What was the whole fucking point of us doing the job in the first place? Look, I know this dude, it's not enemies with C or Dre, but he also don't affiliate with them. 
and we can sell it to them for a discounted price, but it's still gonna come with a risk. It's a fucking risk I'm willing to take. It's either that or I'm on the fucking streets. All right, man, make a call. What up, boy? Happened to your eye? Oh, man. I was dumb tired last night when I went to the house. I went to lay down on the bed and hit the dresser. Hmm. Yeah, all right. Yeah. But what's up? What we doing? For starters, I need you to take me back to the east side. To old girl house where I dropped you off at. So what do you think that's going to do? Spark up some memory? I don't know. We'll see, though. The least you could do is thank me. Bitch, thank you for what? Almost hitting me? Thank you for the gray sweatsuit. Oh, that's why he came to my house dressed like Mr. Cooper, begging for this pussy. <laughs> I hope you had fun. Yo, Freddy! Julio! <laughs> yes, sir. What's good with it, boy? What it do? Not much. We going to your office? Not today, man. I ain't messing with you for too long, man. You got five minutes. I got another meet. Well, I just came up on some shit. Bananas, homie. You gonna want this. I mean, just to watch it sell. You can get double or I'm charging you for everything. Well, if that's the case, why you ain't selling it yourself? You know people. To be honest, that shit is hot. And I ain't got no time to let it cool down. But I know you're gonna want this. This is some high end shit. Trust me. You gonna want this. All right. Where is it? Where it's at? <laughs> Come on. You think I'm gonna be walking around with a presidential rolly on me? Presidential, huh? <laughs> yes, sir. I know you ain't talking about the green face, John. That's the one. As soon as I saw it, I said, man, she got Texas Fred written all over it. <laughs> Man, you can sell water to a well, huh? Yo, CISO, what it do? You rarely, baby. You know what it is? Nigga like to be punctual. <laughs> I heard that. What's up, homie? Shit, sitting here talking to this nigga trying to sell me some shit. <sighs> my nigga who, yo? Shit, my boy C. It's been a minute. Don't tell me you've been hitting licks and ain't been to the shop. Nah. Nah, nigga, today your lucky day. What's that, you got some top of the line shit he just came up on? It's not high end shit. It's more like middle of the line type shit. You know what I mean? What the fuck this nigga talking about? It's not your type of shit, see? It's not your shit. What the fuck you mean it's not his type of shit, but it's my type of shit? See, like that high, high, high end shit. The fuck that's supposed to mean? Nigga, when you ever had some high, high end shit? Oh, y'all trying to play me. Let me go to the car, get the shit, and show you what I got. Sounds cool? That good? Go get the shit, nigga. All right, bet. Mm. We're back. Fuck wrong with this nigga? I don't know what the fuck wrong with this nigga, man. 
We gonna talk business or what? For sure. But before we do, I gotta talk to you about something. What up? Right on the street is, you're the reason your partner missing. So what, you listening to the rumors now? Just wanna hear from the source itself. Is it true? Nah, it ain't. It's my brother, nigga. Let's talk business. Yo, we gotta go. What the fuck? He knows everything, bro. Who, who the fuck knows everything? Drive, drive. Why? See, he knows everything. He was up there, man. See? Hey, what's going on? Oh, oh, shit. Okay, okay, uh, uh, yeah, yeah. We gotta go home and pack shit. Fucking town! Show you that right here on this corner. Alright, for sure. But, but what's up, Uncle? How your shoulder feeling? It's feeling cool, man. I'm feeling nice. Hey, make this right right here, though. Right here? Yeah, man, right here. She live over there. Hey, make the right, my nigga. Alright, All right. keep going. Slow down, dude. Work right here. Yeah. This shit feel real familiar. Uh, I gotta tell you something. What the fuck you gotta tell me? It was me. What was you? I'm the one that hit you. What the fuck you say, little nigga? Uh, I ain't wanna do it. You gave me no other option. Now I know it wasn't you. I fucked up. You shot me. Motherfucker, I helped raise your little ass. I'm sorry, I just want answers. Answers to what? Who killed my pops? I thought it was you. Who the fuck put that in your head? It was C. C? Yeah. He set this whole shit up. The day you picked me up from the airport, I was already here for a week. Yo, what up, nephew? Oh, shit! Oh, man! What up, huh? What up? Always get out the car and greet your fan. I got you. All right. What's up with you, huh? So what you got all that facial hair and all that shit? Man, you know a little something, something for the honeys. You must be eating all that honey pussy then. Oh, right, come on, huh? Gonna end up like Willy Lump Lump. <laughs> so did you tell Dre you was coming? Nah. You said we was gonna surprise him, right? Yeah, we gonna surprise him, all right. We gotta talk. But let's get some meat first. Feed your skinny ass. Good, cause I'm starving. Woo. Damn, Unc, that fool hit the spot. Yeah. Starving. Mm-hmm. Whew. Man. Well, nephew, you know, I don't want to mess up the vibe or nothing, but I told you we got to talk, right? What up, Mom? What you know about your pop's death? Just what you guys told me. I tried to talk to moms about it. She don't want to talk. Found out what happened to him. And who did it. Brace yourself, nephew. You ain't gonna like what I gotta say. And you believe that, motherfucker? I ain't know what to believe. He manipulated me. Just like how he tried to do last night. Last night? So you wanna tell me what really happened to your eye now? Man, who the fuck is you? 
I ain't here to answer your questions, little nigga. Man, what you want with me? You gonna find out soon enough. Unc, what the fuck going on? I told you I ain't when I'm hurt. Man, he was fighting me too much. I told his little ass to stay still. You got something you gotta tell me? Like what? Like why are you driving this car? And why you ain't dead? He don't remember shit. The fuck you mean he don't remember nothing? I don't know, huh? He said he just don't remember nothing that happened that night. What'd he say about me? He thinks you're on the same team. He don't want you to find out. He thinks you're gonna hit the streets and go crazy. So why didn't you call me? There was a lot going on. As soon as I got home, this nigga came and grabbed me. You know better than to keep shit from me, right? I'm out here doing shit for you, putting in work that you should have been doing. So what that mean, huh? I'm trying to get info on the quarterback. He ain't see my face. He saw yours. He heard your name. You think I give a fuck about a nigga hearing my name? That's a rumor. It's a telephone game. By the time the fourth person hears it, the rumor will be Drake killed himself. Yeah, you right, huh? So are you with me or what? Yeah, but what are we gonna do? Simple. We gonna kill Dre. So how you know it wasn't me? Bobby told me. Bobby Boone? The fuck Bobby got to do with this? That's a whole nother story, young. Well, shit, I got all day, little nigga. <laughs> so who the fuck is this Kaepernick looking like? I don't know. We still trying to figure it out. It's a cute little story, nephew, but shit ain't adding up. If Bobby dead, how the fuck he tell you it wasn't me? That's the thing. After Kaepernick ran away, I went back into the house. Bobby was the only one still alive. I tried to help him, but it was too late. He told me that you guys are already suspicious about C being involved in my pop's death. And now with him going after you two, he had no doubt about it. C's the one that killed my father. And I know he wasn't lying. How you know that? Why would a dying man lie to me? I told you shit was gonna get a lot clearer to you, didn't I? You did, but they still have to kill you, huh? What we gonna do? You got a plan? Yeah, I got a plan. But why the fuck would I tell you? You tried to kill me. I'm sorry, huh? What can I do to make this right? Nothing. Only I can make it right. Cuidado por ahí.